In this tutorial, I want to talk about green screen. And we're using iMovie here. So we have in our iMovie library, we see some events. I have my partner, Amani, here. He has two different uh, green screen setups. One is a home green screen, and one is a professional one we did at a studio. So let's uh, get into it. So the first thing we want to do is find a background. So the first thing, whenever you're going to do a green screen, the background has to be on the bottom. So we're going to go ahead and uh, just find this background stars and we're going to just put this here on the timeline and we'll just extend it out some more because I know Imani has a lot more in store for us for his stand up. So here's a stand up. He's starting and we'll we're going to just start and uh, let's see what he says real quick when he starts ready. And I'm going to hit an I for endpoint. Three. And then we're going to hit an I right here. And let's listen. Two more. All right. Let's go back a little bit. And then here we go. So please subscribe to our three, two, one. Okay. So it messes up. We're going to do it again right here. And let's go. Please subscribe to our recipe of the week e-newsletter and receive our free short course to help you start producing videos like a pro. All right. So he's just saying that. Then I'm going to just drag this down here over top of that. Now, when I drag it over top, I have to go to the adjust button. And once I go to the adjust button, I'm going to see this button right here. I'm like, well, how do I make it a green screen? First of all, you have to make sure this is yellow. All right. If it's down here, you will not see the button. All right. Once it's yellow, you'll see this button right here. All right. And once you see that button, video overlay settings. Then I'm going to click on cutaway and I'm going to go down green, blue screen. And voila, he is done. So iMovie does a pretty good job of capturing the green screen. So I want to just tell you that right off the, the bat. Look how good his green screen looks without me doing anything. Now, if I were to do softness or to do something like that, you see, and it was lit well. First of all, if I had to clean it up a little bit or do something else, I could you know, go right on the side, on the edges and do anything like that. But I, I really don't have to. So let's just watch a little bit of a model. To help you start producing videos like a pro. All right. Now let's look at another video. Now he shot this with his iPhone. Now remember, this was not meant for a green screen. It was meant to show. Now you see the difference with this, Amani, and this right here. See how even it's lit. So he has a light behind him. So of course it's going to be hot. So let's go ahead and select this. Now this is with iMovie, of course. I'm going to put it down. And remember, and I'm going to go right here and hit green screen. Whoa. Look at this. Look at that. So you can actually see. So if you have something that's very bad, the first thing you want to do is, can, I get a lot of questions. Can you fix this? The short answer in the iMovie, probably not. You need to reshoot it. I want to show you how to just mitigate it a little bit. So we're going to do this and clean it up. And I have this little cleanup bar where I can just drag and I can drag it as much as close to his head as possible. And I'm just going to just drag that here over. It's basically making a mask around him. And then I can hit this eraser and, you know, I could do a little bit of erasing here, a little bit of erasing there. We'll see what happens when I do that. He doesn't look. You know, then he's out of the picture. So this was not made for green screen. And even if I put the softness there or anything like that, this was made for green screen and it was lit well. This was not. This was shot, as you see, for to get the halo effect in the backlight. So the key takeaways here, uh, ladies and gentlemen, is that you want to make sure you have even lighting. Uh, iMovie will do 90 percent of the work for you. And if you want more information, I have a green screen one on one course in the description link that goes over so many different pieces of software that you can use to use green screen. So iMovie is a great software. But like I said, it has its limitations. Can you clean this up? You sure can with some advanced software and a lot of work. You can make this work. But 90% of the time, you want to make sure that your stuff is even. So you just put it here, hit green screen, and then you go on your way. All right. Take care.